so people with disabilities can have a chance to compete in the sport they like. You might be surprised to hear that synchronized swimming at this point is not part of the Paralympic roster, but we have one 14 year old girl from Toronto who's trying to change that. Ruby Stevens from the Scarborough area right now is rallying to bring the sport that she loves to the Paralympic Games. What do you like best about synchronized swimming? Um, it's in the water. Yeah, and why, why do you love the water so much? Because it helps me feel calm when I'm upset. The 14-year-old who lives with Asperger's anxiety and epilepsy has traveled to Taiwan and most recently Brazil to advocate for international competition. She really wanted to take initiative and look for other opportunities in the world for girls to swim like her, like she has here in Canada. We're really fortunate that we have competition in Canada for athletes with a disability because there's girls like her in other places that don't have that opportunity. Oh. And the rallying is working. The first ever international synchro competition will be held here in Toronto in the spring. That's the first step to having it become a demonstration sport at the Paralympics. I'm pretty excited because I get to compete with just different people. Ruby is selling artwork and has started a fundraising page in order to help her travel and bring more awareness to the sport that's brought so much pride to athletes of all abilities. In a world where they don't feel comfortable in their own skin, to see them have a place where they feel good and where they have people believe in them and where they can believe in themselves, that's everything. And because they love synchro, the very first international synchronized swimming competition with swimmers with disabilities will be coming here to Toronto at the Pan Am Pool in the first week of May. At the Variety Village Pool, I'm Tammy Sutherland, City News.